Welcome to Absolute Drinks with the bartender formerly known as Rico. I am the bartender formerly known as Rico. Today we're making my favorite cocktail of all time. I know I say that a lot, but I'm being very truthful with this one. We're making that classic from the island just near Miami, the daiquiri. Let's get into it, guys. The rum coming through perfectly. Super, super perfectly balanced, bright, fresh. When you get that good daiquiri, it just hits a little bit different. Don't forget guys, if you're liking our recipes by myself, AJ and Hedda, give us a like and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. That way you will never miss any of our amazing drinks. This daiquiri is the best cocktail of all time. I don't care what anybody says. Are we making four? Uh, the original daiquiri is actually frozen. I don't know when or where, when it left this beautiful island near Miami, it became this straight up shaken drink. But if you go to the home of the daiquiri, you will get a frozen daiquiri in a big coop, piled high with a nice big red cherry in it, and they are delicious. But that's not the one we're gonna do today. Today we're gonna be doing the usual daiquiri that you will find everywhere else in the world. It is a shaken drink and you wanna shake this hard. It needs to be as cold as possible. So we're gonna take small tin, and as you know, I only drink with other people. I never drink alone, so I'll be making two drinks today. So we're gonna first add 25 ml sugar per drink, 50 ml going straight in, and then we're gonna add some lime juice. Personally, I like my daiquiris a little bit on the sour side, so we're gonna go for 30 ml of lime juice per drink, which is the 60 ml in total. Oh, beautiful. Okay, next thing is to put that classic white rum here we have some beautiful white rum, and we're gonna go with 45 per drink. And that's it. The daiquiri is one of the simplest drinks out there. It is a part of the Sours family. Following that very simple recipe of two parts spirit, one part sugar, one part sour. And now for the very last final ingredient, don't forget to subscribe, guys. Otherwise, your cocktails, they're the worst. Okay, let's start shaking. Plenty of ice. We want a good hard shake. We want this to be super frosty and super full of ice. Woo. Working up a sweat there. Nice. Camera two. Have a look at all that froth going on. That's how you know you've shaken it well. We're gonna get two nice glasses. I'm gonna take these ones from the front and we're gonna fine strain right in. Next up, the lime wheel. You know how much I love a lime wheel and this really makes this classic a little 80s classic. And there we go. Probably the best drink on earth. The original classic daiquiri. Chin chin camera two. <sighs> You're not gonna get much better than that. Mm. That is delicious. Some of you, I guess not many of you, could recognize my face from many years ago in a very old daiquiri speed mixing competition. In order to do a speed competition, you will need some speed pourers, but I'm gonna need some help. So let's do a little bit of TV magic and get some help in. Welcome back, guys. The AJ's in the house. Are you ready for this, AJ? I was born ready. <laughs> so what we're gonna do right now, we're gonna show you exactly how speed pourers work. We're gonna have a little daiquiri off, a little daiquiri competition. See who can make the quickest daiquiri. We are gonna start with our hands on the deck, and when we finish, we have to put our hands on the deck. Until that happens, the time will continue going. Are you ready? I'm so ready. Three, two, one, go! Mm. 
Can you believe that? I think you didn't put your hands on the... But she did. Doesn't matter. <laughs> the rules are the rules. I also... The rules are the rules. I also didn't throw her limes away. <laughs> <gasps> okay. Don't look at AJ, look at me, camera two, please. Come on. Remember remember why you're here, camera two. Okay? <laughs> this is the help. <laughs> the only help you'll need. I am a bit rusty on this, I'm not gonna lie. But you know what they say? It's just like riding a bike. So we're gonna do 30 and then 50. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay. I don't even remember how to hold it anymore. Already the excuses start. Can you believe this? <laughs> okay, let's go. That's a good one. That's a good 30. That's a very good 30. But I'll beat her with a 50. Get some drums on this. <laughs> you should be nervous. <laughs> Good third day. Told you it was a good third day. This is it. This is the time. Big body bones, I used to be dusty. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. <laughs> that's perfect. Oh, that's so perfect. That's so 10 mils less. <laughs> okay, so we're laughing right now, but that is what we used to call in the industry a manager's poor. So I'm the manager and he's the employee. <laughs> Meaning that don't get served off your bar manager because he's always underserving you. Why? Profit. <laughs> <laughs> So this has been Absolute Drinks with the bartender formerly known as Rico. I was formerly known as Rico. I'm AJ. Don't forget to like and subscribe down below. And we need all the subscribers you can get. And please stick everything in the comments. If you enjoyed this little one-to-one -one battle off, put it in the comments as well. Tell us what you like and we'll produce it for you. Peace. I won. I'm the foot. I'm the winner. Well done. Well done, well done. Well done, well done. Well done. <laughs>